Right, we're now going to look at the few basic essential spare parts you need to take with you. First of all, we're going to look at a coupler on your trailer, and there's quite a few spare parts involved in that. Uh, the first product on the coupler is the coupler shock, um, the bellows rubber, and the buffer rubber. Those products will be discussed on a, on a different video on how to fit them. The second products would be a jockey wheel screw, the caravans with the 60 mil double uh, wheel jockey wheels, it's got a different screw, this is it, and a trailer with a single wheel, 48 mil wheel has got a different screw, this is it. You would obviously take whichever one uh, you need on your trailer, as well as a locking pad that connects to the front end of the screw uh, and the other end to your jockey wheel itself and we'll discuss that on another video as well. The next products we're going to discuss on the wheel assembly, um, crucial to take with a bearing set. The bearing set itself and the fitment of it we'll discuss later on, as well as wheel studs and nuts. It does happen that the studs could break off and for that reason you will also take an uh, oversized nut, it's around about an M16 nut, so that you can fit your wheel studs in the bush. And again, we'll discuss that on a further video. Other essential parts, up to you what you want to take with. I take with some long bolts for my coupler in case um, it happens that the coupler shaves through at the bottom. Bolts and nuts of various sizes which I keep in my little container. Hose clamps. A handbrake knob. anti do Spare parts pertaining to your electronic systems. A uh, seven pin male plug as well as a seven pin female plug. A Brad Harrison plug or an Anderson plug for your charging system between your vehicle and your trailer. And then some extra fuses, 50 amp fuses for your vehicle charging system. Last but not least, some cable ties. You can use this anywhere. Also, a additional charger. In reality of uh, the African camp resorts, they run on generated power. And with the spikes of generated power and the switch on and switch off of the power, your power pack can get damaged. 